<laughs> Hi. What are you doing? There's a shortage of dumbbells these days due to the Rona and everybody wanting to create home gyms. We found a local CrossFit box that was selling a bunch of dumbbells. So we went and picked up a pair of 30s and a pair of 35s. But as you can see, they're very... Uh, very worn and rusted. Yeah, they're pretty, they're pretty bad. So anyways, Rachel found a video on YouTube that showed you how to restore these and make them look literally brand new. The guys were in way worse condition than ours were and they looked brand spanking new when he was done. So that's what we're gonna try to do. All right, so the process is wire brush, vinegar, vinegar and water, and then Rust-Oleum spray paint. What Jen is doing now is scrubbing the weight with a wire brush to get all the just loose rust or loose coating yeah. that's on there. It's not like perfectly stripping it, but yeah. like I'm scrubbing it as good as I can to get it as much gunk as right. possible. The next process is literally stick them in five gallon buckets. Stick them in five gallon buckets. Use half a gallon of white vinegar, fill the rest up with water, and we're gonna let them sit for about six to eight hours. So we let them soak for longer than eight hours. Yeah, they've been on for almost 24 hours, actually. Yeah. And, I, and it's fine. Yeah. They're looking pretty gross, though. The water is. Yeah, it smells like vinegar out mm -hmm. here. But I think it's pulling some stuff off. Mm -hmm. The next step is to take them out of here, leave them wet. Yep, scrub them again with a uh, wire brush. Yeah. So and then you let them dry. We're gonna pull them out of here. And while they're still wet, we're gonna scrub them real good with this uh, wire brush. So we'll see, we'll see how clean they get now. Yeah. About to finish up, but you can see how filthy of a mess yeah. this is. And this was all rusted. Yeah. And they do look a lot better already. Like a lot of the rust came off. I would say, what, 75% yeah, of it sure. came off of there? So that's good. We're going to finish these up, dry them, and then we get to paint them. Yeah. And man, once we paint them, these things are going to look brand new. Yep but just prepare to get kind of messy and yeah. gross. So if you just look at this, I mean, you saw this one before it went in there, how rusted it was. And now, I mean, it's still, you know, it's still dented and pocked. It's not perfect. But once you throw a coat of silver paint on that, that's gonna look brand new. So next step, you pick you up some Rust-Oleum hammered here. This, we picked the silver because the weights are silver and we felt like it most closely matched its natural thing. We saw another video where a guy did black and the black mm -hmm. looked really sharp as well. It did. But we're gonna do the silver and I'm really excited about this. I know, me too. So we just got done with the first coat and I think it looks really, really good. The dumbbells look really nice too. Yeah, I think this is gonna be nice. Yeah. Yep. I really do. We're gonna do a second coat on these and get it all, and then we'll show you what the finished product looks like. Are you hiding them for the grand reveal? All right, let's show them how they turned out. Ta -da! They turned out really great. So for reference, these are our weights we had before, which are nicely used, not beat up. Too bad. <laughs> <laughs> I think one thing that we we probably would have used black mm -hmm. paint, but the silver or the hammer color is just fine. Let's see the plates. These turned out really nice. Yeah, too. I think those are really nice. Yeah. Yep. But like Rachel said, if we were to do them again, I think I would do black simply because the black plates would then match our black bumper plates, and I think that would look sharp. Here's. You ever seen those people that pretend that they're statues? Yeah. And they have the silver body paint on? Yeah. 
that's what this makes me think of. Yeah. And while it looks good, you can tell that it's a fake veneer. I think if they were black, it wouldn't be so obvious that they've been repainted. Right. That said, they do look really, really good. And yeah. what a great way to restore old dumbbells. Absolutely, or, or, or metal weights in general. Yeah, so I am very happy. Yep, super easy. With how these turned out. And it really wasn't that much work. Mm -mm. Nope. If you do try this, leave a comment in the comment section below and let us know what color paint you used and yeah. how yours turned out because I'd be curious to see how this works for other people. And if you found this video helpful and you are going to attempt to do this, hit that like button. Helps a lot. And also subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And we'll catch you in the next one. Yep. Bye. Bye.